I'm so embarrassed. I can't believe I'm putting this on the internet. My room is a disaster. Very much tell. I filmed a outfits video yesterday, so that's why everything's on the floor. Um, I promise you my room doesn't normally look like this, but the reason I'm having so many issues putting my clothes away is because I have way too much right now. You guys know my job is basically trying out a bunch of different styles and clothes for you guys and styling them while I love having clothes and trying out new clothes. My room is small. I'm not able to hold all the clothes that I want to keep and I love being able to sell my clothes online for you guys. A lot of the pieces I have end up being sold out by the time I show them or expensive. So I love using apps like Poshmark to sell my clothes at a really discounted rate for you guys. So thank you so much to Poshmark for sponsoring this video. That's crazy to me. I filmed a video, second video I ever filmed, I talk about Poshmark and in the video I say This isn't sponsored, if you thought it was sponsored, look at my subscriber count, it's not sponsored And now it is sponsored but just shows that I love Poshmark. I've been using them for years now to sell my clothes before I had a following and it still worked for me. I was able to sell all the clothes that I wasn't wearing anymore and make a little bit of money, which is so amazing. You guys know that I do get clothes for free a lot of the times now. So when I end up selling my clothes online, um, anything that I got for like a brand deal, I sell for $5 and then whatever I bought with my own money um i'll sell it at what i think is like reasonable just because you guys get it i hope that that comes across okay to you guys oh did i even say i'm cleaning my entire room today i'm not just gonna clean my closet i'm cleaning everything because my room's a disaster and my mom's in town my dad's in town too um they came to stay for the weekend so i've decided I wanted to film this video now while my mom was here <laughs> because it's more fun to clean your room with a friend so if you've been looking at your closet or looking at your room thinking dang I should really that's Ernie I should really start cleaning or get to cleaning it turn this video on and start cleaning this is a motivation video for you to clean your room if you need to and start selling your clothes online because I know it can be kind of scary to start off selling clothes online. It seems really intimidating, but it's not. It's so easy. All my friends use Poshmark and sell their clothes on there. We also buy clothes all the time on Poshmark. That's what my first video is about, is buying and selling your clothes online, which is just so funny to me that I've come full circle. Poshmark truly is the easiest way to buy and sell clothes online, finding your favorite brands. I've talked about this before. I've bought RUMI, Reformation, uh, North Face, Aritzia, so many clothes, your favorite brands, all on Poshmark. And all of those items are up to 70% off retail price, which is just crazy. Now, whenever I even think of an item that I want I just check on Poshmark first because it doesn't hurt to just check on there before paying full price listing your clothes is super easy also just take a picture of your item and post it with a description I highly encourage trying on your pieces before listing them I'm not gonna do that today because I feel like a lot of you have seen these pieces on me before and I'm posting so many pieces on Poshmark that I just can't try them all it'll be way too long so make sure to check out poshmark you can use the link in my description to download the app i'm gonna have so many of the items i'm showing today listed there for you guys to purchase i've done a closet cleanup before and i sold my items so many of you guys loved it and it was really cool interacting with you guys just in a different way and seeing you guys rock the pieces that I've loved for a while now. I just have too many clothes and I don't wear them, especially with not going out very much and all that kind of thing. I'll wear things for a video and then I never have a place to wear them. So I want my clothes to get a good long life and they are just sitting in my closet being sad and lonely. So here we go. Let's recruit my mom to clean this room. I just sit back and make her do the whole thing. You guys, I really don't want to, but we're, we're motivating each other, okay? We're doing this together. My mom's on my bed right now. She Hi. Has, she doesn't <laughs> want to be on camera. Um, <sighs> but she's going to help me pick. My closet doesn't even open. What am I picking? I don't even know. I what need I'm to get rid of things. Oh. We're selling things on Poshmark. <laughs>
it has. Ah, little white shorts. Cute, you have more shorts. <laughs> she knows me. I don't know why. Nice 12. I wear these shorts. A little slip dress that I never wear. Black cardigan. It's cropped, so I won't wear it. Can you help a little bit? I'll throw them at you me. and yeah. you put them in there. I love all these pieces, but I'll just never wear it. You have too much. I do. Too much. No? Um, I like it, but um, I'll keep it. You'll keep it? <laughs> <laughs> Lisa said she wants it. Hey, y'all, I was looking for these. It's going to take forever. <laughs> Fun stuff now, jackets. Is that a raincoat? Yeah. I've never seen you. Yeah, I don't like it. Let's just see. don't. Try on, try on. <laughs> Fine, I'll keep it. What, you wanted it? No, it's alright. I've never, I mean, I got it this summer. It's perfect if it's raining, you just, and it's not, you know. No, but there's not a hood. Oh, yeah. Is that kind of stupid? Who makes a raincoat without a hood? There's nothing in it, there's not a. No, I got this from Goodwill. That was such a fine when you bought it. I right? know. That's why I feel like attached to it because it was just such a good. Maybe just take it home for a while and then. Just you this see little it. zipper bothers me. This is how much it zips. Oh my goodness. What is this? And then you tuck it, like tuck the one side in when it gets cold. Do you know what I'm saying? Like what you were yelling at me yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, just kidding, I don't want this. I found it, thought I'd really like it. I'm not a best girl. Found this from the thrift store. No? I don't wear it, Mom. You need another bag. I'll be back. Here, take this one out. We've already got one full trash bag of Poshmark. I'm selling this brown leather. I have a, a one I like better now. It's, I just don't think I'll ever wear this. I feel guilty. Why? I don't know. So, this is cute, but I just don't wear it. It's so long, and I always think I'm gonna wear it, but I don't. What am I gonna do? I gotta clean up the ground. I'm gonna switch to time lapse. You guys can watch me clean the ground because this is clothes I just wore, so I'm not giving away any. And then I'll switch back for the other side. Okay, my mom already left me. Time to work on this section. The clothes are fun to like have you guys actually watch me go through because I can show you what's gonna be on my Poshmark. But like this kind of just junk, I'll just do time lapse because I think that's better. <laughs> I don't know if it's called claustrophobia. I like think everything is being claustrophobic, but I'm pretty sure it's just being anxious, you know, where you like can't breathe. But if I'm in a tight space and like I can't walk in a clear path and I like hit things, it's like my biggest pet peeve and I'm just filled with rage. And then I start like acting crazy and like hurting myself and then I get more mad. <laughs> That's what happens. So I hurt my fingernail. It's too long. This shirt is getting sold though. Uh, I'm gonna sell this little H&M mesh. I bought that with my own money recently too, which is kind of stupid. Here's broken hair. It's so weird though, cause like, I'm still not going out, so I don't wear these clothes. I'm gonna sell this little top too I got from h and I'm trying to find like those mesh tops for you guys and see if they were nice and they're okay. I found this <laughs> at thrift store and I just don't wear it. A little craft one, this one's so cute and I know so many of you love it. I love this, but I don't wear it. This is so cute, but I won't wear it because it's cropped. I need to start remembering that. This, yeah, I'm not gonna wear it because it's cropped. I think I'm gonna sell this one too. I just don't wear it. Should I? I just don't wear it. I'm not gonna wear it because it's cropped. We're really cutting down. Okay, let's do shoes. I don't think there's a lot I'm getting rid of. I like my shoes right now. I donated and sold a lot of shoes in my last one, but this video is gonna be a lot of um, jeans and purses, so. Don't worry. Okay, I never knew this, but you can donate like skincare and yeah, like shower and bath goods at Salvation Army and Goodwill. I know you can in Chicago and Michigan. I'm not sure other places, but I'm gonna donate. I have so much skincare that I get like 
PR packaging. Your girl only has one face. Can't use it all. So I'm just gonna donate the skincare. I just feel, feel, I don't know, I feel funny selling it. I'm gonna donate this little purse too. You know what's coming for you? You know what I'm gonna sell? This is gonna break the internet. Everybody wants these. They're sold out everywhere. I did buy these with my own money. I wore them outside once. They are a size US 7. Yeah, a women's 7, men's 6. I bought these on ASOS because I wanted to do a video with them and I really liked them. I wanted like to buy them too. Um, but I wanted to do a style video because I hadn't seen anyone do like a lookbook with these. And I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna do that. So I did it. These shoes are so freaking tight on me because I am a size eight and I shoved my foot into a size seven because when I went to go return them on ASOS, because everyone said they like ran a full size big and my regular Jaden Doc Martens are a seven um, and those fit. They were already sold out of the eight. So yeah, I bet these run like a half size big because I can't get my foot into a seven. These are probably like a seven and a half, a true seven and a half. I would not say they run a full size bigger though. Whoever said that is lying. So I'm gonna sell these on my Poshmark, okay? So if you're watching this video, go check my Poshmark right now because it might be on already. I'll definitely sell them for less than what I paid for. I'm not gonna jip you guys and sell them for more just because they're sold out everywhere. That's such a scam. Yeah. I guess it's not. It's not a scam. Do whatever you want, but I'm not gonna do that. Okay. Mom already went shopping. She's wearing my new clothes that I was just trying to sell to you guys. <laughs> looks good though. Okay guys, the docs might not be on my Poshmark because my mom is trying them on right now. Oh yeah, so do you think they're true to size? Oh god, yeah. Do you think they're too tight? Or no, perfect? Look perfect. Yeah, because those are seven. seven and a half. Or, oh, are they? Yeah. Oh yeah, these are seven. You're seven and a half. Go, so go half size down. I would, but your my toe kind of hits the front of them. Yeah. But um, they're mom. so oh, sorry. <laughs> but they're so wide. Yeah. That you need them a half size smaller, I think, because they're really wide. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so yeah. So I yeah. wear seven and a half. So yeah, half size down. Everyone says go full size down, but no. Um, sometimes I wear an eight though. I think Nike. My I'm gonna eight? sell my um Nike MK2s that my brother hates. But yeah, Nike really like. eight. My mom is at Nike eight. Doc Martens 7. What a true size guide. Thanks, Mom. Are you going to try on all my things and tell me if it's true to size or not? Oh my god, you look like a clown. <laughs> Do you think they're comfy? No, I think they're horrible. I'm also going to sell these after I raved about them. I just have too many white shoes, and now that I have the Jordan 1s back in my life, I don't need anything. Yeah. I'm selling these because I got my, my other cowboy boots now and I don't need two pairs of cowboy boots. I'm gonna sell these little brown loafers. Ah, am I? No, I think I'm gonna keep them. Hee <laughs> hee, I really want the Gucci loafers. No, I'm keeping these, hee <laughs> hee, sorry. Should I sell these? Never. I know, isn't this cute? I just, I, look how many I have. I can't, I cannot. I'm selling this one too, it's from Marcia. If you want, and this has been sold out forever. Um, it's literally the Prada dupe. It's the nylon purse. I just don't use it. How cute! Remember when I found this and I was so excited? I won't wear it, and I already got an Instagram in it. I'm gonna sell it. My mom's putting a coin in every purse because she said it's bad luck to sell a purse without money in it. So, so you're all getting at least one penny off. I know, it's jail. I just bought this purse. How cute is it? Um, it's Rebecca Minkoff. Doesn't it look like the YSL bag? Yeah, for a fraction of the cost though. It's my birthday present. Oh, looks like I've used this so much. So, it's so cute though. No, you're out of quarters. Chapstick. I actually use this purse for like how tiny and dumb it is. So it's one of the first things I ever just got for free. So cute though. I'm keeping it. Sorry. You're I'm gonna sell this because it looks just like the new one I got. But this will be for five dollars on my Posh one. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. I like the one. I'm selling this one. Oh, jackpot. Absolutely a jackpot. Oh my god. I love looking through my purses. Oh my god. Sell these. You don't miss them because they've been for a year. <laughs> I'm gonna sell this tie-dye bag. 
because I have two and I don't need two. I'm not sending this bag. It's so weird when I end up getting emotionally attached to. Like oh, this, I this I is a one. shopping bag that yeah. I tie-dyed. That is a tie-dye bag that I bought, I think, from like Topshop or Zara. But this is the one I'm keeping. So this little saddle bag. That's super cute. This is gonna be a whole new bag. So these are uh, whatever. I'm also gonna sell these ones. So many of you love. And then these Princess Polly jeans are really big. One of the buttons broke, but they still fit fine. Um, I'm going to sell them. <laughs> because I have these Tommy ones that look similar, and I like them better. Tommy Hill could go one. Uh, these are another pair of dress pants. A white pair of jeans with that slit at the ankle. These will be five bucks. I can't get myself to get rid of these because they look good on my butt. So these two. And I'm going to sell these little pastel trousers that are super cute. And these pinstripe trousers that I've worn a hundred times. I have to keep that. Uh, a little midi skirt. Tie-dye midi skirt. These are those split hem leggings. I think I have a few pairs of those. Here's another pair of split hem leggings to sell. Those are my sleep time shorts. What are these? Oh, these are just a pair of flare um, yoga pants that I'm gonna sell for you guys. I'm gonna do a quick time lapse of me cleaning this area. Look who's hiding in the pile of junk. Did you guys even see him? Who's hiding? Thank you so much for watching this video and giving me the motivation to clean my room. We have four full garbage bags that I'm going to be selling on my Poshmark and we got three garbage bags of clothes I'm going to donate to Goodwill. So I would say it's a major success. Thank you so much for motivating me to do this and I hope I motivated you guys too to also clean your room or just sell some of your stuff online. Thank you again to Poshmark for sponsoring this video. Can you tell my energy is like completely plummeted? I'm very tired. That took a long time. Thank you so much to Poshmark for sponsoring this video. Make sure to click the link in the description box. Download the Poshmark app or if you already have it, make sure to check out my profile for all the pieces that I'm selling. And I think that's it. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. What? Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to. And I'll see you in a few days. Bye.